Good morning, good morning, the sun will shine at breakfast time, because it's breakfast in the morning for you. Just got out of bed, don't even care about the hair anymore. Oh, things are going crazy. Got my coffee. Five sugars. Let's see what we got. Orange juice this time. Fatty bear, croissants, I'm gonna eat those. Fruit bowl, pineapple bowl. Now I changed it up. Remember last week I did uh, I did a menu change, someone's dropping bottles out there. I did a bit of a menu change to see what the different things are. Well today I got pancakes with maple syrup. I'll pick up the pancakes so you can see them. And they smell like they're some um, saturated in sugar. Give it a little love. Mmm, special. Anyway, so I'm gonna dig in. That's breakfast for day 10. Only four more days to go. Four days, guys. And then I'll be out of here. And uh, I'll give you a bit of an update on my dad next. Okay, so a little bit about my dad. My dad has been having some rough nights. If, you, if you're new to this, my dad... Uh, the, uh, I'm back. So my dad has, uh, has prostate cancer and he's currently in hospice. And that's the reason I got the call. Got to be almost two and a half weeks ago that uh, I should come home. And so I've come home. I'm kind of putting out there. The dad's not doing so good. You know, I have hope and I have... Uh, and I, I believe... Uh, that things can get better, uh, but on the other side, there's also a reality to old age and, you know, the fact is that our lives end and he's had a good run and he's got some loving children and a loving family around him. I just want to be able to see him before anything happens. This is what's so hard about quarantine in this environment, in my situation specifically, is that you can't leave anywhere. You can't go anywhere to go see family or to be with your loved ones, especially in a time of tragedy and crisis. I'm leaving straight from here. My brother's picking me up uh, where my dad is, which is about five and a half hours southeast of here. I'm just saying this now just to give you a quick update on what's going on. It's never ever pleasant, but I'm trying to keep a positive frame of mind. I've had some very emotional nights uh, talking to my mom. I'm okay, just would appreciate anybody out there that is the praying type to continue those so that I can see my dad uh, before anything uh, worse happens. I do have to tell you a secret. I watched a movie today instead of the cricket. The cricket wasn't on, it was a movie. I'm so sorry, I, th I actually did think I was gonna have the cricket on 24 seven. I like to say 24 seven because you know, people love exaggerations. Millions and millions of people exaggerate all the time. That's actually true. That's not an exaggeration. I bet that's true. I'm gonna think of something to do today that's gonna to be special for all of you viewers and it's gonna happen right now. <laughs> And just like that, after a super productive morning, it becomes lunchtime. Smells very good, so I'm excited about what today may bring. I'm gonna eat this salad. It is tomato, cucumber, and lettuce. One of my favorites, just the basics. I have this, the, the put eggs in it. It's got a crumbly base and a uh, pleasantly creamy top. You can find all my uh, food critiques on Yelp. Ooh, they've given me something that I don't understand. I understand that that is chicken. I know what grilled chicken is. But they've got a, a cake down here. I'm gonna have to rip into it to find out what it is. I don't know what I don't know what it is. It's a it's a cakey like a like a crab cake, but I don't think it's not crab. Something else in there. And then a whole bunch of beans. Grilled chicken, crab cake thing with no crab in it, and beans. Large day ten. What? And an apple. And another Mars bar. I have three Mars bars. That is lunch, my friends. Back to your regular programming. And here we go again. It's another time for that special part of the vlog. Open that. Open that envelope. Open that envelope. Here we go. Didn't let me finish. Envelope. Here we go. July two. Not long to go. Only like. Four days, I think. Anyway, here we go. It's got a note. I know it's kind of dumb, but hey, it's something to do. Those are my favorite notes. <laughs> she couldn't put the whole box in there, but it looks like it's a Lego, Lego kit. Well, let's get a cracker.
And now for my favorite part of the day, someone just called from downstairs and said that I have a Uber Eats order. Someone surprised me with it. Oh my gosh. So McGregor's, you beauties. Jen and, and uh, Garner McGregor and the kids. <laughs> they got me a pie. They got me a meat pie. These things are awesome. Gosh, they got me a little tart. Look at that. Look at that beauty. <laughs> oh, I'm so ecstatic, you have no idea. Uber Eats is the best. The McGregor's are the best. Everybody else out there. Mm. No, I'm just joking. You're all great. But this has made my day. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You made the vlog. Uber Eats, out. Ooh, end of the day. Going to have some dinner, are we? Yes, we are. I just want something simple. I'm not sure I'm going to get it, but it's okay. I'm going to see what I have and go from there. I have a salad. This salad has little onions in it and peppers. It's a pepper salad. It's a pepper salad with some noodles. Noodle pepper, pepper salad. I have a dessert here. Uh, it looks like a cake. It's a cake. Okay, I have, I have something to say. The last two times that I said that I had Indian and I thought they were naan bread and I remember the little silly little yellow tongue naan bread, which was probably highly offensive. I think that was something else. I was talking to a friend of mine, Jordan, and he said that it might be Blah, blah, blah. It was something else. It was actually a thing. It's actually like an Asian cuisine type thing. And I butchered it and said that it was Indian food. Because what do I know? I all say all that to say this is clearly Indian food. This is clearly naan bread. The other bread that I had, the, the la, 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 not naan bread. But this is a curry. A definite Indian curry dish. And I'm excited to eat it. So that's dinner for day 10. You like that? If you, you could just do that all the way, just go, hey guys, it's day 10. Hey, nice to meet you. What else could you use that for? Ooh, cool clothes, daddy-o. I'm gonna eat now. Just kidding. Ah, uh, everything's fine, I'm just sitting here uh, in between the TV and the desk. <laughs> just something new, fascinating life I live. This is day 10, it's uh, getting late and I am completed for the day. I hope you've enjoyed this as much as I've enjoyed producing it for you. That's about it from Room 308. I did the trick shots, I ate food, I opened that envelope. To be fair, I'm running out of stuff to think about to do. I know some of you have offered suggestions, some I can't do, some I won't do. <laughs> you know who you are. Four days left. Count them down with me. Thanks for coming along. See you next time. Guys, quick update. I know it's really late here, it's like 10.30, but they called me. I was oh, just about to get into bed. No worries, because I'm not really doing anything. I'm no, no one's time. Can you see me okay? Sorry, it's really dark. But this came. Somebody dropped me Uber Eats at 10.30 at night. Now, most people would complain. Me? Nah. I don't know who did this, because there's no names on these orders, but I got an apple pie from McDonald's. Caramel sundae and a latte. I'm gonna save the latte till the morning because that would be ridiculous. Uh, but I appreciate it so much. The caramel sundae, which I will eat, and the apple fry. What a great treat to the end of the night. I realize everything in this vlog is food related. This should be a foodie vlog. Um, actually all of them are, because that's basically the excitement that I have every day is just the meals. But thank you to whoever did this. I want to know who you are, I want names, I want numbers, I want email addresses, I want social security numbers, I want the credit cards, everything. But man, this is great. Anyway, see you tomorrow.